Hello everyone, welcome back to LSPDFR. So guys, uh, I'm going to let you know what's been going on with LSPDFR. As you know, the last video we done was Route 4 Rockstar updated GTA 5. So, Rockstar updated GTA 5, and then I had to update everything. Everything updated. I got everything put back in. Um, and then Open 4, which is the modding software that we use, it updated. So, I had to update Open 4, and when I done that, everything, all this had been redone. So, I don't have anything back in yet. I don't have the belts and everything that I was using back in. I got just about everything back in. So, give me a little bit more time, and we will get all that squared away and get everything back in. So, for this video, since we haven't done one in a while, we're going to do a Los Santos County Patrol. We're still using Jurisdiction 5. I'm going to see if I can get, um... Campus PD to work because I really, I really do want Campus PD. So we're going to see if we can get it to work in Jurisdiction 5. Maybe that's the way I can use the other juris, um, Jurisdiction 4's mod to make it work. We'll, we'll see what we can do with that. Um, but So just give me a few minutes here and uh, we'll get set up. Alright, so let's make sure call outs are on. We are ready to go. We use the tw the 2016 Explorer. Dispatch to all SWAT units. We have an assault with a deadly weapon. All units respond. Code 99 emergency. So we have um some multiple agencies in here now. We have some more SHP agencies on the map, and I will go over that stuff with you a little bit later and what I've done. Um, I, I'm not a modder, so some of this stuff I don't know how to get it to work. But I figured out how to make it work to have multiple SHP agencies. So we do. Um, and I've got it to kind of spread it out where they spawn. Uh, like two of them are spawn in Blaine County. Two spawns in Los Angeles County. And two are spawn down the city. So it works really well. And we'll, we'll go over all that. Go ahead and uh, unscroll lock it there in case we need to. And let me pull over right here. I forgot to start my timer. Yep. Oh, all right, we're we're good to go. So we got our timer start. We're ready to go. Uh, also, guys, I've had some comments on the Red Dead Redemption series RDR. Uh, videos uh, they have not updated Rage Plugin Hook. I've checked into it. Rage Plugin Hook has not been updated for Red Dead Redemption 2. The latest version of Rage is not supportive of the new version of the game. So, as soon as they get it updated, we're gonna turn around that vehicle. As soon as they get it updated, we will be uh, doing some more, but it has not been updated. We got a traffic stop here. We need to anger our vehicle here. Just like that. Target vehicle license plate. To Charles Zebra 037, a traffic violation. Approach with caution. Calls are on. We'll make sure. All right, let's talk to him. Good morning, sir. Stop to you, call our ARPR system. Come out and say you have expired license. Let me get your insurance and ID, please. Let's see some ID, huh? All right, sit tight. We'll Thank be you. right with you. So we're going to check him out here and see what he's got here. He does have an expired license. 240 days expired, so... We get a citation for that. The vehicle is clean. All right, we'll give 
give him a little citation here. Be cool if you carry your hand. Alright, sir, today you're gonna be getting one citation. It's gonna be for a driving with an expired license or over 240 days expired. It's gonna be a $500 citation. Alright, uh, and you're very lucky we're not taking your vehicle because we're gonna be taking your vehicle today, but I'm gonna catch you a break and not take it today. So have a good day. So we'll turn around here. Well, this we've got an outstanding warrant. It's like if we'll stop them too. Fuck it. If they don't run. Plate here. Target vehicle license plate. A smart zero, license has a warrant. Queen, zero, one, zero. Instead of warrant. A traffic violation. A warrant issued. Approach with caution. So I'm gonna get one backup unit out of here since we do have a warrant. Backup needed. Involved. In uh, Richmond Glen. Good evening, sir. Trooper Burnett with the Los Santos County Sheriff's Department. Stop you today, can we get our ARPR system come back and say that you have a warrant? Get your license registration, please. We'll make sure Let's see, some ID, see if huh? it is you. All right. Thank you. Sit tight, and we'll be right with you. Uh, driver is nervous and sweaty. Let's take a look at it. He does have a warrant. Evading arrest. Alright. Let's get him out of the vehicle. Alright, sir. We're going to need you to step out of the vehicle. Alright, walk up here in front of my floor. Alright, sir. So today you'll be, you'll be placed under arrest. You do have a warrant for your arrest for evading police. Right evading arrest. So you will be placed in custody for that today. You have anything on you uh, that's gonna uh, hurt me, poke me, anything like that? We're gonna be, we're gonna pat you down. All right, he had a small flashlight, a baggie of capsules, 2.5 grains, kilograms, in a total of white powder taped under a subject's. The subject's arm <laughs> and an op unopened bottle of gold beer. All right, so we're gonna test that powder and see what's going on with that too. We're gonna put you in this uh, charger back here. Citizen 
citizens reporting a civilian shot in Vinewood Hills. I don't want to see that shit again. Roger, we're heading over now. So we're gonna search the vehicle, then we'll uh, we'll check the um, what that white powder is. Alright, in the vehicle on the driver's side had a pair of pencils, a pair of women's lingerie, uh, passenger side, nothing else, strong, enough interest, huh? So, nothing really in the vehicle. Uh, don't open the door. Will you open the door for? Close the door. Flatbed. Assistance required in, uh, Richmond Glen. So we're gonna test this powder here. Uh, that one's no. Uh, heroin. Positive for heroin. Okay. So he'll be charged with a heroin. He'll be charged with uh, his warrant. And I do apologize, guy, for the videos. I've been trying to get some get some other stuff done. Um, I'm currently we're looking for more work right now, but uh, Ellis Pretty Far takes up so much time to try to keep it running for you guys too. So that's why there really hasn't been nothing else on the video. So he's gonna be took in for his charges. What is going on with this tax? Why are this tax required in Richmond? What are you doing? Glenn. What are you doing? What are you doing? Thank you. Oh crap! Damn it! Uh, just run over us. So we're gonna get back on the road. Let's see what else we can get into. Out uh, here in the county tonight. We have to make sure and watch, make sure we don't go into Blaine County territory. And we're not going to just do traffic stop. I'm going to see if we can get some calls. Attention all units. Assault with a deadly weapon in, uh, Tonza Hill. Alright, this may be in Blaine County. We're going to respond over there. Got an assault with a deadly weapon. Let me look at it real quick. Uh, no, it's it's an arcade. Okay. Oh, I didn't see that vehicle. I was my <laughs> I was looking at the map.
Hey guys, I'm not using Visual 5 right now. I'm, I'm using, I mean, uh, natural, uh, the new, um, I'm still using Visual 5, the old, uh, remastered version of NVE. Uh, the new version, I don't, uh, right now I'm gonna wait for it to get updated better. Um, I've had issues with the latest version, so I uninstalled it and went back to this, and I think this works better. Now, the old version of Natural Evolve, uh, remaster it is it does say out of date but it does work We gotta jump right here with the weapon. I kept God mode on. The only reason why I do that is because sometimes you get up in these mountain areas and uh, the mountain lines will take you out. I need to run it without God mode. Ambulance. Though. Assistance required in uh Tongva Hills. Knock my head off. Alright, he had a letter threatening the uh, LCPD, the LCPD chief, a receipt, a fresh a bottle of receipt, an open bottle of whiskey. I'm not going to read the whole thing, I'm just going to abbreviate, abbreviate what it says. I think everybody kind of knows what we're talking about. When we say, and just wrong with the medic, go ahead. You idiot. Okay, he didn't survive, even though the medic got her over three times. And he's gonna run over him too, so let's see if we can move him out of the way. So the ambulance don't run over them. We'll put him over here and we'll call a corner. Assistance required in Tongva Hill. We'll move our vehicle. That corner was, was right around the corner. He was here in a minute. Knock my hat off. Are they gonna run over the corner? What the fuck? Hey, watch your language. We've got a serious MVA in Morningwood. Units respond code two. So we're done with that call.
Look at Fort Sincuda over there. That's what that's gotta be, is the military base over there. All lit up. So we'll see what else we can get into. This takes us back toward Chumash. We've got an 11351 and Lavo Zancudo. We'll go ahead and turn around on that. We're right here at it. It's a police impersonation call. Then code three response to this. They gonna run? No, nope, they ain't gonna run tonight. We're right inside of Blaine County. So we're gonna have to call a jurisdiction unit out here. We are inside of Blank County's territory, so. Target vehicle license plate. Uh, plate's Zero one clean. David Ocean George 680. Target is 10-4. So we'll get one. It may show a lot of Santos County go around the edge, so we'll see. But we're gonna get one unit out here. Assistance needed in Lago Zancudo. Good evening, sir. We uh, got you stuck. We got to call you uh, police impersonating tonight. Let's see. Can we talk to him? Yes, we can. All right. What's going on here? I'm off duty. I'm with the... Good day. Okay, so he basically he says he's an off-duty officer, so we're going to get his ID. Let's see some ID, huh? We're going to see if he is off-duty. Thank you. Yeah, it is a Blaine County unit. Uh, he's not showing that he's an officer. Okay. Well, in that case, we're going to have to take him in. Alright, sir. We need you to step out of the vehicle. Well, our records are showing that you are not an officer in the... Um, in no department here in the state. Move! So, follow me over here. Right here in front of my floor. You're under arrest! gonna pat you down. You got anything on you that's gonna illegal on you tonight? It's gonna hurt me if it stick me? Uh, he's got a, a kid's plastic badge, a loaded revolver, and a wallet. You got a, a pistol on you, sir. What's this pistol? Why you got a plastic badge on you? You're not talking? Okay. okay.
Okay, you open the door? Why you open the door? Man, you don't see that shit every day. Okay, I don't know why you're putting him in our vehicle. But that's okay. So we're gonna search the vehicle. It's fucking weird. All right, he had a, on the driver's side a police radio, scanner, handcuffs, parking tickets, and a cigarette. Cigarettes. The passenger side had nothing ventures, trunk, nothing ventures. Flatbed, assistance required in Lago Zancudo. Come on, come on, open the, what are you, what are you doing? Open the trunk. We're gonna call this weapon in. Okay, the weapon is valid. Well, let's see if he has a gun license to own it. He is a security guard, supposedly. Okay, he does have a gun permit, so we're, we won't worry about that. So we're going to be getting in, what is it under? I've seen it before. It is under... Public defense, I think. No, that's not it. Uh, I've got to find what it's under. Let's see. Wouldn't be equipment. Wouldn't be vehicle. I'm not sure. I don't remember now what it's under. I'm trying to find it here. It is under... I, I did see it not too long ago. I did see it. In, in, unless this one don't have it. And I'm pretty sure it does. It has a parking... <clears throat> it's equipment. No, it's not under that. Let's see. Moving violation. It's not under animal health orders. Temporary government from COVID-19. I, I was thinking it was under this. Let me see. That's shoplifting. Yeah, impersonating a police officer or a law enforcement officer right here. We're getting for that. He does own the weapon. It is in his name and he does have a gun permit, so we're not we're not gonna charge him for the weapon. I had to find it. It's been a while since I've had that one. Assistance required in Lago Zancudo. And they'll take him in. Dork. What is going on with this traffic? So we'll head back over into our county.
What is this blue car doing? What the? Uh... Okay. We'll stop him for that and see what's going on. Be out on no traffic stop here. Target vehicle license plate zero six Robert Frank Ida eight zero five. Target is ten four. Good evening. Dep Deputy Burnett with the Los Santos County Sheriff's Department. We we'll stopped you for your uh, U turn you down on the road back there. Let me get your last registration proof of insurance. Let's see some ID, huh? We need anybody else's IDs in the vehicle. Thank you. Let's see some ID, huh? Thank you. All right, y'all sit tight. We'll be right with you. And with uh, more than one in the vehicle, we're gonna go ahead and get one backup unit out here. Backup required in Lago Zancudo. Alright, so we'll see what we got here. It about looks clean. It just drive a little erratic. But just be on safe side, we're gonna get one unit out here. This is the gentleman that's driving. So we're gonna wait on our other unit to get here. Copy that. Taking a look. They should be here in just a moment. The Blaine County unit. Yeah, we are still in Blaine County, so. I got you covered. All right, sir. So today you're gonna be receiving one citation, and that is for careless operation of motor vehicle. I would uh, choose a better place to turn around next time. I understand you need to turn around and go this way, but you can't do it in the middle of the road, so. Here's your citation. And y'all have a good afternoon. Oh dear. Yeah, Lord. we're uh, we're all good here. They uh they turned around the road back there. That was the whole issue reason why we stopped them. We was head back over in our jurisdiction and they turned around the road. So let me go ahead and get them out what of the Let me go ahead and get them out of here. We'll go ahead and dismiss them. Appreciate you coming out and helping us out here. Thank you. Head back over to our jurisdiction. Cause technically, we're in Blaine County right here. Moderns, if y'all want to put a red light somewhere right there, is where you need to put one. You need one there bad.
So we're gonna see if we can get another call. All units, we have an ambulance requested in Tatapia Mountains. Units respond code 3. We are a poor uh, carjacking up here. They're running. Go ahead and get a chopper in there. Attention all units, we've got units requesting air support. I grant the following. Let's see if we can catch up to them. Go ahead, go ahead and notify Del Perro PD uh, that we're heading that way toward the city. Assistance required on um, Great Ocean Highway. We're trying to catch up here. Dispatch, suspect located. Moving to engage. Dispatch, we got eyes on the target. Moving to engage. Yeah, Pearl, yeah, Pearl should pick it up. Go ahead and know if I state. Attention all units. Assistance needed on Del Perro Freeway. Units respond code 3. Acknowledging. On our way. Dispatch, we got eyes. We're in pursuit. All right, we're trying to catch up this pursuit. We're not doing bad. Getting off here. All right, we've called it to it. Charger. Like they're heading toward the airport. Did that suspect left the freeway? Inside view here a little bit. Oh, it really slows us down going up this hill. I'm not close to oh, no. We're damaged pretty bad, our vehicle is. Go get more state units. Assistance needed on um Elite Field Freeway. Dispatch, purpose off the freeway. Copy that. Moving right now. Dispatch, suspect located. Moving to engage. We was up with him in that, that dang AI truck. Did what he done. You idiot. We're in pursuit. 
We got him. All right, see if we can get a rope, a tire spike on him. Our vehicle's damage has been slowed down by the damage. What right, about La Mesa? I believe that's where we're at, is in La Mesa. Yeah, La Mesa. Heading toward the docks. Backup required. No vibe from Port Authority. We have a 1099 and Elite 10 Island. Respond code 3. Dispatch, we got eyes on the target. Moving to engage. Getting Port Authority involved. Love these wild pursuits, guys. Right, we're gonna see if we can stop him. Backup required. All right, they got his tires. Get my vehicle out of the way. I don't know if that's my siren. Nope, that ain't mine. So we ended up down here at the dock. Our vehicle's damaged. Alright, come over here. I wish you could get out of here with that siren. Yeah. And shit. Hey. If that's you gone, thank you. We'll get rid of him. There we go. And him. Way. 
So we had a little accident back there with an officer and it throwed our, our SUV into a wall and messed up the back of the SUV. Partner's gonna watch him while we uh, search the vehicle. I don't know where that siren is coming from, but it needs to stop. We have a person with a stolen tire on. vehicle license plate. Four seven Henry Spire, Charles. Four seven eight. A traffic violation. Approach with caution. This is Adam Five. Copy that. We'll keep an eye out. All right, on the driver's side, I had enough interest. Past side, I had a box of twi twisted handbags. The trunk had a kidnapped ransom note and a empty O blood bag. Typo blood bag. Okay, I don't know what they've been doing. Go ahead and get this vehicle out of here. We're going to get a Port Authority unit down here so we are under jurisdiction. Once they pick that vehicle up. Alright dude, what's your name? Alright. Now we're going to call a Port Authority unit in. Backup needed in Elysian Island. Now let me patch you down here. Copy that, dispatch. Alright, he's got a postcard from Las Vegas. An empty bottle of light beer. And he was the driver. Suppressive fire coming up. We're gonna put him in this in power. No way, this is fucking nuts. Hey, watch your language. Cover coming right up. I wasn't expecting this video to go this long. <laughs> But that's good though. Alright, what's your name? He's got a suspended license. We're just gonna charge both of them with fleeing. Um, he was a passenger. Um, he's gonna be going for the same thing. Uh, he had a broken USB drive and a a pack of gum on him. For now, we'll put him in our vehicle. What in the hell? Alright, get out of the way. We have a suspect on the run in the GWC Engulfing Society. Units respond code 2. So we're going to get both of them from fleeing. I don't know if it got the other guy's name. Let me see. Yeah, there it is. We'll get him for the same thing. He was a passenger, but you know, he was in the vehicle, so he's going to be charged with it. Let's see here. He's just going to charge him with fleeing from police. Alright, so we're going to get a, 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 a unit down here. A 
assistance required in Elysian Island. We're gonna send another unit to pick him up. What that do? We'll wait right here. We're gonna send another unit. Here they come. And that one disappeared. Here comes the unit to pick this one up. Pick this Whoa. guy up. Yeah, our explorer took a little bit of damage in the back right there. Busted light. You like the wheel messed up on it. <laughs> it's got some damage over here. Right there a little bit. Mm, back window like it may be busted out of it. Alright guys, so that's going to be it for this Los Santos County video. Um, it got wild right there at the end. I love them, but I love those pursuits. That, that's what makes it good when you get them long pursuits like that. That's what's fun. Get them long pursuits. So, thank you for everyone that's been watching. Thank you for subscribing. Uh, more content will be coming. And have a good night.